Hey guys, what's up? This is Lucullio. Um, coming at you guys with another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Z. This is the first time I've recorded in a while because um, school's a struggle. I just gotta make sure my face. Yep, there we go. So, last time we left off, um, we caught a new Pokemon, new member of our family, which is Shinx, and we named him Diego. I'm gonna go ahead and apologize to you guys if I sound nasally. It's because my allergies have been killing me all week. I mean, everyone's been cutting grass, and plus there's dust everywhere because our building doesn't know how to clean anything. So anyway, um, name him Diego, and um, we I did some off-screen grinding again, but I didn't do it um fully yet because I figured that you guys would want to see an evolution, um, and where Riolu. A.K.A. Leonardo. Speaking of which, I'm gonna go ahead and put him in the front so I can raise the French up a little bit. All right. Well, anyway, um, I know that you guys probably want to see an evolution, and we're like Leonardo and uh, Galaxy are already at level 19. Um, Diego evolves at I believe level 15, so that's the reason why I stopped at level 14, so you guys can take a stab and see. Uh, we're well, not take a stab, but see an evolution and. Then, um, afterwards I can do some off-screen grinding from there. But anyway, um, yeah, so we're up against an Abra. Ooh, scary. So, hopefully this quick attack will knock it out. And it does. Nice. Alright. Yeah, and I mentioned in the last video, if you beat an Abra before he uses teleport, good for you. And in one pile of grass, we bump into a hoo-hoo. Wow. That is really random. Well, as much as I want Leonardo to evolve, I think I'm going to train uh, Diego for a little bit. That might be the smarter idea. Well, anyway, um, well, while I'm on this adventure, you know how I've been struggling to give topics. Well, uh, my girlfriend, Lady Dunsparce, as you all know, she um actually gave me a really good topic for you guys to talk for me to talk about to you guys, and it's collect like collectibles. But more specifically, she wants me to talk about my pop vinyl collection. <laughs> because, um, for a while I've been, um, addicted to, um, pop vinyls. And I would buy, like, just anything that I liked, really. Um, <clears throat> but, like, right now, I have all the Attack on Titan pop vinyls. Even the, um, Aaron, the Hot Topic ex exclusive Aaron Titan form with it, when his, um, Rage form. I have that one. And, um... I'm working on a Dragon Ball Z collection as we speak, and um, right now the only one I'm missing is Goku, and my roommate Gujra for the win, or and his real name is Dave, um, found a Goku one at Hot Topic, but he didn't buy, bother to buy it for me because I told him I'd pay him back, and he was like, eh, maybe not. What the heck? And not mansion exit. Whoa. This place is weird. It's like a maze. <laughs> oh god. Well anyway, um so um yeah, one one thing's a one thing I really collect a lot is pop vinyls and um I have a really cool collection going on. Um I also am trying to collect the Big Hero 6 pop vinyls. Right now I just have um Baymax and Fred. But the one that I really want is um Hero Hamada because not only is he the main character of Big Hero 6, but he reminds me a lot of myself. Uh-oh! Diego just reached level 15. Are we going to see an evolution? Yes, we do! There you go, Diego. Second episode. We barely got him for, like, an episode, and he's already evolving. Wow. Sweetness. Well, as you guys know, I did do some off-screen grinding, though, so that explains why I got him now. But I still got to train with him a little bit so he can catch up with uh, Leonardo and Galaxy. So good job, Diego. Oh, by the way, if you guys are wondering why I call him Diego, it's because in the last video I went over time and I had to, I was in a hurry to um I gotta save this I was in a hurry to um you know I'm gonna try to find these items too I was in a hurry to get um done with the episode and the first thing that came to my mind when I looked at um a Shanks was Diego from um, the Ice Age movies um I like the I didn't like the last Ice Age movie to be honest. But that's it for another topic. Actually, that's another good topic for next time's movies, because I love movies. But anyway, um, so, back to the other topic, which is collections. Um, right now I'm just talking about my Pop Island collection, but I'll get to others in just a second. So, um, I also have all the Lion King ones. Like, I have all the Lion King ones. 
Once again, I'm sorry about what you're about to say, because I'm just... I'm sorry that you guys had to see that. My nose has been killing me. Well, anyway, um... So... Um, I have all the Lion King ones, all the Attack on Titan ones. I want all the, um... <gasps> Whoa! Holy crap! We may have found our fourth member. Hang on, let me check my team here. Okay, so I have Galaxy, Diego, and Leonardo. Let's do it. We're going to catch this guy. Alright. Don't you dare knock him out. There you go. Good job, Diego. Alright. We have found our fourth member already. I love Zorak. Alright. So, let's see. Where is the Great Balls? There we go. Probably should went to the right instead of the left. Awesome. Oh my god, please stay in the ball. Please stay in the ball. Three. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! We got Zora. Yeah, boy! <laughs> awesome. Alright. So now, I gotta think of a name for Zora. So it's a black fox, basically. Yeah, it is a fox. But it wasn't a Zorark, which... Says it's a fox, but uh, it looks like a wolf. So I gotta think of a name for a cool name for Zorark. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think about popular foxes that I know. I mean, there's oh, let's call it McCloud. Yeah, like you know, the Star Fox. That'll be cool. So. Awesome, we already got our, well, technically sixth member. Um, I'll just go give you guys a brief recap. So we have Diego Galaxy, Diego the um, Luxio now, Galaxy the Staravia, Thing Baby the Geodude, who is our strength HM slave, Afro Duck, who we started with, but I didn't want to keep because, well, he's not going to be really handy to us, Leonardo the Riolu, which hopefully soon will be a Lucario, and McLeod the Zora, who I definitely want to use on this team because I love Zorark. Um, I just need two more Pokemon. I would love to have a Water and a Fire type, or a Dragon type move, or a Dragon type that can learn a Fire type move. Just I don't know. I mean, now that I think about it, I don't know if I want to keep Zora in the team because I like I like to have a Dragon type. But then again, having a Dragon type is a hassle. So I may just say um, I'm gonna stick with McCloud. So oh man, I didn't buy any potions. I should bought potions. Well, um, that's something that I'm gonna have to do. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. I know it's a long journey back, but um, the thing is, though, it's just like, uh, damn, how how close is um, Leonardo to leveling up? He's not really too close to leveling up, but he's close enough. Well, anyway, um, what I'm gonna do is because I really want a Lucario, I need to switch out with. Uh, come on, switch with the Diego, because. Um, I'd like to have a Lucario soon. So, I don't know, like, how long it'll take. Last time I had a Rio Lula, he evolved at level 22, so I'd love to have a Lucario. And it'd be kind of funny if he just, like, decided not to evolve, and I just had a Rio Lula for, like, the rest of the series, and he just kicked butt. I wouldn't mind that either. I just love Rio Lula and Lucario. So, ooh, we managed to get the paralysis up and it matters because it's just light, level 19 little rock and roller that's not going to... Oh, never mind. It just got a crit on us all of a sudden. All right. So, anyway, back on topic while we're doing all this. Um, another thing that I've been starting to collect recently are Pokemon and... Um, what else? Pokemon and, and other anime plushes. Like, uh, right now, um, I want, like, like, once again, I'm going to try to collect all the Attack on Titan plushes, because I'm a huge Attack on Titan fan, which would be another good topic for a video, is anime. There's so many good topics we could do. Well, anyway, um, so, um, right now I have, let's see, I have Captain Levi, Vegeta, and Trunks plushes, because I love Dragon Ball Z, too. Dragon Ball Z is my, one of my favorite animes, personally, because it was one of the first, of course. I'm not, not trying to, you know, do a bandwagon or anything. And the Pokemon plushes, right now I'm starting by collecting all the evolutions that have been sold in stores recently. Um, right now I have um, Jolteon, which is my favorite evolution, as y'all know. Um, Umbreon, Espeon, and Leafeon. I'm collecting them in the order of favorites. 
because my first favorite is Jolteon, then it's Umbreon, Espeon, Leafeon. Next, I want Flareon, then Vaporeon, and then, uh, what's that, Glaceon, Sylveon. And of course, I gotta get Eevee in there somewhere, too. But Eevee's not really part of my favorite evolutions because it's not even an evolution, but, you know, it's Eevee, so I want, I'd like to have Eevee. And, by the way, um, that walking challenge, uh, my, my college did a walking challenge, and I won. Walking challenge basically is like where you get a team of people to walk and report your steps in, and I managed to win that, my, my team and I managed to win that, and, um, I was told I was going to get an Amazon card by one of the people who was running it, but instead I got a $75 card to our local bookstore, which is bullcrap. I'm so mad about that. Uh, my girlfriend, Lady Dunsparce, is really wanting me to post a video of me reacting to that, but it's really embarrassing because, um, gosh, I get so mad. Like, I just basically tell people to stay away from my college because it's stupid, and I don't, I don't, I don't know if I should post it, but... Um, I was one, the reason why I'm, I brought that up is because um, on the Pokemon plushes, I wanted to get um, the Mega Blaze Kid and Mega Lucario plushes to put in my background for when I hopefully do openings soon. And, um, well, I'm not going to be able to get them now. And I'd rather not spend 30 bucks a piece on plushes. So, yeah, they're large plushes. They're like, I think, a foot tall. But um, I just don't have the money to do that right now because I'm a poor college kid. Um, the Eevee plushes cost like 12 bucks a piece at Walmart, which is really cool, but, um, I can only buy a little at a time. That's a level 12 Zora. We, we, we caught a level 9 Zora, and then we just bumped to level 12. But I'm not gonna be picky, because we already caught McLeod, and plus we can always do off-screen grinding with, uh, McLeod. And I think, uh, Zora evolved into Zora at level 32, if I'm correct. So, grinding him up to our level is not going to be an issue without any pause. Um, I really want Riolu to level up and evolve. And I know that he evolves during the daytime, too. So, this is the reason why I'm doing it right now. So, um, yeah, another thing that's going to be a problem is like doing this at nighttime, which means I'd have to change the time so I can evolve Riolu. I mean, I'm probably going to have to cheat and, <laughs> you know, just... Um, like change my time just so this game will be on daytime and I can evolve Riolu because I think Riolu only evolves with max friendship in front of the daytime. But yeah, I'm trying to get all these items just to see what they are. Another Murph Pro, which hopefully won't, won't be a problem to um, knock out. By the way, I also want to apologize if um, I look kind of hairy on this. I haven't had the time to shave in a while. Gosh, this week's been really busy because um. Because Monday, oh, potion, good. I had, on Monday, I had a band concert. Then Tuesday, I had um, a friend's recital to play for. Um, it was one of his senior recitals. And senior recitals, for those who don't know who are music majors, is basically the recital to decide whether you graduate or not. I had to play for one of those. And then yesterday, Wednesday, I'm recording as a Thursday. But anyway, um, Wednesday... I had a um, another senior recital to play with my good old friend who wanted to play as a group piece so he can uh, make himself look good and stunky. Or, I hate stunky. Well, anyway, um, and then today I have a percussion ensemble concert and I'm trying to squeeze in the time to record because um, the reason why I'm doing that is because um, this is the only time I have to do it until Saturday. Or, Friday or Saturday, because here's the thing. Um, Friday, I do I don't have classes and I can easily post, but um, I'd rather post right now when I know I have time. Because I, I like to keep this consistent to where I upload every day at noon, and I won't be able to do that um, you know, if I just wait until Friday to record, because if I tr wait to record on Friday, I won't be able to record until late that evening. And I'd rather record during the daytime, that way I can, um, you know, get Riolu to evolve into Lucario, but, um, like I said, the worst comes to worst, I'll just, um, change the time so it can be daytime and uh, when I evolve him, and hopefully that'll level him up. Yep, there we go. Are you gonna be a Lucario now? Dang it! Okay, so, Leonardo is not evolving yet, even though we've been buddies, we've hung out. Oh, well... I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to keep him up front so I can 
get the max friendship going on here. Because I want him to like me during the daytime. Oh, great ball. Nice. Sweet. So, we made it up for the one where we helped with McLeod. And... Let's pitch again. Okay, well... I'm going to go ahead and force Palm it. Might as well just keep training with uh, Riolu while I can. Because, um... In order for McLeod to catch up, I have to grind with him. And I still, I I still gotta do some off-screen grinding with, uh... Luxio as well, aka, um... Diego. So... We, we see Murkrow, of course. There's just so much dark looking in here. But anyway, um... So... What was I gonna say? Oh, uh, yeah, collection. So, as you guys know, I do play the Pokemon TCG, but I'm not a collector. I'm just a competitor. Um... I only compete because, um, well, I don't know, I just, I just don't want to collect, like, cards and be like, okay, I have to have every one of each set, like, I just want to keep it as a, at a game playing thing, but, yeah, that's pretty much my reason behind that. I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh, but, um, I just have to quit that because playing is really freaking expensive compared to Pokemon. Alright, so here we are. Let you through? Ha! Huh. I'd only let you through if Odin himself gets defeated. So you're telling me that I just came up here from nothing. Beautiful. Okay. So, I guess I went the wrong way. So, we're gonna have to go back. Okay. So, a little disappointed that we had to come all the way for nothing. Well, hang on how much time we got left. Okay, we still got about roughly 10 minutes left before I have to come to a close. So, I think I'll record for about 9 more minutes. Um, I'm still going to train up my Riolu because I really want him to be Lucario. But anyway, um... What was I going to say? So... I don't know what I'm say. Okay, so I think we went the wrong way. Um... I'm trying to think, is there anything else I want to say about collecting, collecting stuff? Oh, yeah, we did go the wrong way. Okay, cool. So, wait, is this the guy that said that he liked rap music? Oh, that probably goes from Dark Pokemon. Okay, well, we're still traveling through a route. I mean, gosh, I can't believe it's taking so long. Well, well, oh, no. Oh, okay. God. Want to guess who's already got two gym badges? You have two guesses, and the first one doesn't count. That's right, me. Maybe I'll make a gym. I forgot my voice for this guy, so I'm just going to keep doing These gyms are awful anyways. I could live in a mansion and hand out the swag badge all day. Oh my god. What am I doing? You? Me? Let's go. Oh jeez. I did not see that coming. Okay. So he's got only got two Pokemon. That's just good. Oh, he's got Charmander too. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. So hopefully we can knock this out with a brick break. Yeah, there we go. Good job, Riolu. I mean, Leonardo. I'm trying to call them by their na like nicknames. Horsey. Hmm. This would be a good opportunity to um, get Luxio some leveling up. So let's go ahead and go into our Diego. And, aha! This battle is over. Why? Because I have better Pokemon than you? Nice try. And hopefully that'll take care of the horsey, and it doesn't. Wow. That wasn't expecting. But Bubble should be fine. Yeah. Wow. What a pansy. So he ended up taking out uh, Jake in quite a few turns, and wow, that was a lot of experience. No! My swag! Screw your swag. We have awesome Pokemon. Okay? I'm sorry. Darn! My swag! Ruin! By the way, in case you guys want to, want to know, the reason why I'm not saying these cuss words is because I want to keep this channel family friendly. Because I feel like that that would give me more support. And plus, I don't really like to swear. But anyway, my swag! Ruin! Again, screw your swag. Just pass. I've had enough of you anyways. You shouldn't have messed with me, Riola, or Leonardo and I. Finally, we're in Onega Town. Ooh, a diglet. Le diglet. Seriously, like, don't get mad, don't get, like, 
all mad at me because you're not as good as I am. Jeez. <laughs> I didn't see that coming, but luckily for us, he was not a challenge at all. All he had was a friggin' Charmander and a Horsey. Level 1, level 14, one, level 16, I believe. And we have, like, a 19 Staravia, a 20 Riolu, and a 15 Diego ready to go. And I still have to grind with the Cloud here. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put Thing Baby in the PC and, uh, Afro Duck so we can have a little room for more Pokemon. I don't have to go there, so we'll go ahead and, uh, deposit, um, Thing Baby. And I'm probably gonna regret that, but oh well. Because there might be some more Pokemon who have strength. And there we go. Yes, exit from the box. So, we'll go ahead and save right here as well. Um, we have a few more minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and walk around and observe. And see what, oh, don't lag on me now. You haven't done this in a while. So apparently, I think the second gym is here. Oh, look, it's a Pidgeot. Back here, Pidgeot. Pidgeot. Or maybe not. Okay, so I'm not going to do the gym yet, though. Um, ooh, there's a lot of berries. Okay, well, I'm gonna pick those berries off-screen, probably. Unless you wanna see me do it on-screen. So let's see what these people say. Hello, can I ask you a few questions? Yes. Okay, what is your name? Lucilio. What a lovely name. Lucilio, this questionnaire is about the Superior City Gym. Do you find the battle with Devon difficult? I'll say yes. Oh, which would you say was the stuff of Pokemon? Riolu, of course. That was the one that gave me the most trouble. Hmm, interesting. Do you think that Devon is a good dream leader? Yes. Oh! I'll have to give these answers back to HQ. Thank you for your time, Julio. Here, have this. A great ball. Okay. Thank you. Glad I could help. And thank you for helping. Have a nice day. You too. Alright. So, let's go ahead and explore the city a little bit. I don't know what this is, but I'm having a feeling that if I bump into it, something bad will happen, so... Have you heard of Gideon? He was a cool actor once, but then he got injured, and he's at the gym now. You should go fight him. Not yet. I will eventually, though. Be quiet. I'm making a documentary. Yeah, about trees. Like, what are you doing? You're just recording a tree? That That's definitely exciting. Oh, Nagatown, what a beautiful place. There are flowers everywhere, and some legends even say that Shaman once lived here. I apologize for my terrible impersonation, but I just like to have fun. So, ooh, there's an item. An item, 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 and there's the cave. Poke ooh, a poke gear. So we have to find it instead of attaining, attaining it from someone. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Um, yeah, I already talked to this bald guy, Mr. Clean over here. So, um, yeah, my game's lagging all of a sudden, I don't know why. This house is oddly empty. It gives off a strange chill. Okay, so something tells me that maybe we'll bump into the road. The TV is giving it a strange static noise. The static is morphing into words. What gives you the right to disturb me? Do you know who I am? No. Then let me tell you, my powers are far beyond words. What the hey? Let me see what happens whenever... Um... Yes. Do you know? Who am I? Oh! Oh, okay. What? You are correct. But how? No matter. I cannot let you live here alive. Oh, snap! Okay. So... Things just got real, and unfortunately I have to switch out because, um, Riello can't do anything because it's electric and a ghost type. So, who can I do something with? Oh, I'd hate to say to switch out from the, my Staravia and it doesn't do anything, but we'll try. Sorry about this, guys. Uproar, okay, it's just doing uproar. So hopefully we can do some damage to it. Wing attack, come on. Do something. Yeah, there you go. It's not very effective, but it's effective in my book because we're taking it down pretty quickly. Thank you, Galaxy. Oh, maybe Galaxy can get up to level 20 as well. Catch up with Leonardo. Okay, so that's not very effective. He's going to do uproar. And then, of course, Rome calms down, and this will take care of it. Bye, Rome. I can't believe this thing wanted to kill me. It doesn't even look like it hurt me. There we go, level 20. All right. Okay. Well, that was random. Okay. So, is there any more randoms in here? I feel like that. Um, there's gonna be more to come. So, I'm guessing that. Um. Well, that, that was really random. <laughs> okay. Well, there's one more house to check. It's a pigeon flies over our head, and we're gonna go ahead and check that out before I close. And let's see what these guys do. 
Hey, 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 let me talk to you, let me talk to you. Hey, 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 get, get over here. Hey. There we go. I'm running around making a mess of the place. Good for you. You guys waste of time. My grandkids are running around making a mess of the place. I wish their parents would come... Was it come... Home soon. Growlithe. My Growlithe is so big. His fur is so soft. You're soft. I'm playing Pokemon Leaf Green. I chose Bulbasaur as my starter. He's the best. Good job, Pokemon Zeta. Good job. I see what you did. Okay, so we're going to save this right here, and we're going to go ahead and um, put a close on this video. And, guys, I want to thank you so much for watching. Uh, please subscribe to this channel if you want to see more of this. I, I do upload daily, or at least I'm trying to. Um, it's just so hard because this week is terrible, and the next week is finals week for my college. So... I'm going to do my best to upload a daily, but I need some time to study and do recitals. And I need to go ahead and get off. Hope you guys have an awesome day, but more importantly, stay cool.